welcome back to another episode of Animal Crossing and we are going to build a bridge. We are going to build a bridge with Tom Nook. Oh ho, curious about bridges and inclines? Yes, excellent. Because with the renovation of resident services, here's something new for the getaway package participants. This makes it easy and fun to add major projects such as bridges and inclines to the island. Everybody who lives on the island can freely contribute towards the construction fees. We can discuss your island hopes and dreams, even if you don't quite have the funds yet. Either a bridge or an incline. That's fine. We don't have any inclines right now. We do need to get some for the future. But I want to make just a small bridge across the river to our new plot, who Mallory is moving into. Who I don't know who she looks. I don't know who she is or what she looks like. But that's fine for now. Oh, okay. So we need to pick a bridge style. Mm -mm. And maybe we should just go for the cheapest. But do I want to go for the cheapest? That is a good question. I think I want to go for the wooden bridge. The suspension bridge is kind of cute. And the log bridge is, bridge is very simple. A wooden bridge... Oh my goodness, okay, I'm gonna go for a wooden bridge. It is a lot of money, but I think we could pull it off. Alright, and I also want to get another house kit. I'm doing construction today. Let's talk about infrastructure. Um, I want to sell some land. I think we have one land left. Ah, so you'll help prep some land for a future home. That's fine, Tommy. Just take all of my money from the bridge construction and the plot of land. That's fine. Goodbye, 10,000. I wonder if this is our last kit. Or if there are any more to put after this. Alright. Thank you, Tommy. Thank you. Alright, so where are we going to put this new house? I think we should have probably two houses over the uh, over the river where the bridge is gonna be between because that way she has a neighbor Marily Maril uh what was it Mal <laughs> how have I already forgotten the name Mallory Mallory that's it okay Mallory's um needs a neighbor okay so okay she's gonna be on her own otherwise okay how big is this bridge that's the question bridge mock kit there's no river <laughs> What? Of course there is a river. I was standing right next to one. Okay. Let's imagine it. Oh no, I was taking my tree out. Okay, hang on. That is a good place. I want it there, but I also want to keep this tree. So, two seconds. Let's just shake this down. Pick up a few things and eat this apple so that I can pick up the tree. Perfect. All right. Um, apple tree. Perfect. All right, bridge. Do what you must do. Uh, this is the spot. Yay! And the little gyro guy is there! Look at him! I haven't met the gyro guy yet. My phone is ringing. Oh, really? Tom Nook! Hello, Olive! Tom Nook here. Did you find a good spot for the wooden bridge? Uh, yeah. Perfect spot. Wonderful. Now, as part of the kit you set up, Lloyd will stay and collect donation for the construction fees. Island residents contribute little by little. Once we reach our goal, construction will begin. Of course, you can feel free to make what hefty donations you want. And if you don't make any hefty donations, our goal might never become a reality. Anywho, our construction donations should go to Lloyd, and we'll talk again soon. Hmm. How fun. <laughs> I wonder if you did actually leave it, if it would just not ever get filled up properly. I'm going to put as much as we can. Oh my goodness, that is a lot of money needed. Let's put as much as possible in. Oh, Lloyd. I'm going to need this. I'm going to regret it. There we go. So, uh, now we have a, a lot left to give. But we've put as much as we can. And now we have to collect a lot of money. 
but that's fine. So this is Mallory's new spot. There we go, Mallory. And I'm gonna put another new villager over here, right next to the waterfall where this fossil is. All right. I'll move this a bit. I wonder if it's gonna take up this tree. I hope it doesn't. Uh, I think I want it moved over a bit, but maybe not. I, I want it moved over one more, but I don't want it to take out the tree. Is it gonna ruin your tree? Let me imagine it. That's exactly where I want it though. Yeah, it's gonna move the tree. That's fine, I can replant the cherry tree that I have. It's sad getting over a tree, but I can't be bothered to, to go in and remove it. Alright. Let's just put the tree that we picked up. No area to place. Yes, there is. What are you talking about? What? Here. There we go. Now you're happy. Enjoy, tree. Plot available. There we go. So we have another plot available. Ooh, okay, we're doing good things today. We have a solid plot over there to Mallory. And let me just have a run around on this side because I don't go this side much at the beach to see if the bottle is over here. I have some coral and no bottle. Okay, perfect. Let's run across this side then. Bottle for the day. Are you over here? Actually, shells are really good to pick up and sell. So we'll go and sell these now. It's worth the running around because the money you get from them is really good. Alright. Go and we need the bottle for the day. I want my DIY. If it's going to be a Halloween DIY, that would be even better. You hearing me, Mossy Grove? A Halloween DIY would be perfect, please. Ooh, and a really expensive butterfly that is. There. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. And apparently the pumpkins and the tomatoes and everything are really good to sell as well. As well as the coconuts. Coconuts are always good to sell. I'm actually gonna think I'm gonna pick up all these and sell these. I know I was keeping them, but we can always collect shells again. And they're just causing chaos on the mossy beach. Let's see. So, tea olive starts. Oh goodness, I'm gonna be messy again and just chuck these down. Nobody look. Close your eyes. I'm gonna drop stuff here. So I can pick up more things to sell. Mama bear. Cushion. This is the stuff we got from the recycling box and also that we bought from Tommy's a few days ago. Drop. And the sushi. Drop. Pretty sure that's not healthy to drop sushi on the floor, but that's fine for now. A little grasshopper dude. Oh, there he is. Got him. Alright, migratory locust, you are in the pot of gold for our loan for me to pay off. And for the bridge. <laughs> He's contributing. He'll be he'll go to a nice home as well. I'm pretty sure Flick comes and picks them up from uh, from the boys when I sell bugs to them. There we go. Coconuts! And no shells there. And then this bridge. Let's see. Oh. Gotcha. Oh, just as it nearly flew away. Perfect. Any shells? Teddy! Hi! Hey, Olive. Long time no see. What are you up to? Me? I'm up to almost 7,000 push ups a day. Bet you can't beat that. No, I definitely can't. I can't even do one. I can barely do one. All right. Let's pick up the rest of these. And, oh, there it is! There's our bottle for the day. <gasps> Perfect. Okay. Let's see. Open! Ooh! <gasps> it's so pretty! It's mushrooms! Oh my gosh, it's so autumn-y. Here's a secret. And I secreted it. A weird DIY TV show I watched at 2am told me to make this. So I did. Here's the recipe. I thought it smelt good, so I wanted to share that smell with you. I hope you make it too. The DIY Crackle. Who 
die. Crackle who die, D-I-H, die? Hmm. I'm confused. A cracker, oh, a clacker cart. There's Vesta in the background. Right, what does this look like? Is this an autumn recipe? Whoops, no, I didn't mean to do that. It is not an autumn recipe, I can see, because it's not in the seasonal. Okay, it's just a little, a little toy. Interesting, I did not know that's what it was. Um, let's say hi to Vesta. Vesta, Vesta, where does she go? She's hiding. Hi, Vesta. Hey there, it's been a while. Mossy Grove seems kind of empty without you, Buffalo. Oh, Vesta. It's okay. It's lovely to have a goal, don't you think? I'm hoping to run fast, so I've been asking around for advice. As an experiment, I tried running with something with some gentle yet persistent pushing from Teddy. Not to complain, but that big sweetheart refused to push me very hard at all. It looked like we were out for a pleasant stroll, according to Rosie. Oh well, if you have any other ideas, I'm all theirs, Olive. <laughs> it's so cute that they like quote from all the other villagers, like they've all had a proper conversation. It's really, really, really cute. I love how some of the new um, conversations are like that. The new dialogue and text. It's it's really, 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 really cute. It adds personality as well. Is this butterfly going to come down? <gasps> no! Damn it. Okay. <laughs> I missed it. I missed my chance. Some wharf roach on the beach. On the rock over here. Thank you. And the last shell. Alright. Let's run and sell all this at, at Nook's Cranny. And then, I guess, we can do a bit of clearing up. And more money making. Because <laughs> we'll forever need... Oh yeah, we can plant some of our bushes. Let's see, I'm actually going to plant one in front of the new guy's house. I think it would be nice for him to have some bushes about. Like, a yellow tea start seems such a nice thing to have in front of your house. We can plant some in front of everybody's houses, actually. It would, one would look really good here. And maybe also the side. Just to add some variation to the village's little outside plots. I think it would be very cute. Vesta, do you want one? Let's see. Maybe one like right outside her uh, can I not put one here no I can't hmm okay maybe I'll put one okay maybe not I was gonna put one instead of in front instead of that but it doesn't matter that's fine <gasps> hey balloon okay we have full pockets but I can pick it up another time or we can swap it out for something <gasps> oh please be a Halloween DIY okay um oh boy yeah, white hyacinth Enjoy your life planted. Uh, present. What are you? 500 bells. Well, there we go. Mossy Grove is naturally contributing to the um, the building of the, the bridge. That's very fun. Picking up these sticks as well from when we went around shaking. Oh, wow. We have a full stack of sticks. All right. I'm going to plant one behind the cute little washing line i think this is rex's house there we go and i'll put the weeds down because the weeds look cute planted and then we just need one for rodney oh is that one of the bugs do we have this yet is it new? Is it new? No, it's not. It's a tiger beetle. Okay, well, yeah, we had one of those before. That's fine. Let's go and say hi to Rodney. He's in his little house. We're gonna plant a bush here for him. The last tea bush. Yellow tea bush. We have a, a pack of orange ones, I think. I'd love to plant, uh, plant one of the orange ones next to my house. Hi, Rodney. Ooh, your house has changed. You seem somehow different since the last time we met. New outfit, new hairstyle, spill the deep. Oh, Rodney. Looking for a rap session with old Rodney, eh? What's the latest, Rodney? Ah, so you noticed a cac- a cacae- oh, oh, cocoa tree, is it? A, ca a cocoa tree? 
Ha, huh. well, we can't see your quicker tree, Rodney. <laughs> Didn't think I had a green thumb, did you? Wanna guess what color my toes are? <laughs> okay, so all at once he pointed out an invisible cocoa tree and he pointed out that his, that his toes are green <laughs> oh rodney you're so precious well there we go his cocoa tree is actually a very nice cocoa tree and i was actually looking at it when we came in because i love the touch of green it doesn't really go with his his house though which is a bit confusing but maybe he bought it at the uh, local store all right rodney you now have a cute little bush outside your house um, how many of these tree branches can you pick up? A lot. Because it looks so messy here. Ooh, that was a rice. A little rice grasshopper. Come to me. Bingo. Got him. Okay. We're going to have to swap him though, I think. Yeah. Let's just put the pile of sticks down. All right, and onwards to Nook's Cranny. Hopefully we've made a good amount of money. Ooh, I can't help myself. We gotta catch this to sell. A whole pile of stones. Alrighty, how much can we make in one go? Full of full pockets, full of stuff to sell. Alright boys, I've got loads and loads of things to sell. Like the cardboard box I actually don't need. I'm gonna keep some of this, keep some of that, but the shells you can have. This, 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 this. My summer shell collection you can have. I need money more. Hand carts. Oh, the grasshopper. The locust even. I'm sorry, sorry, locust. I'm s uh Thirty-six thousand nine hundred thirty. Good. Okay, that was a good haul. Wow, it's cleared out the entire <laughs> inventory. Yes. Okay. Cool. Let's see. We have a couple of things to put down, and then we can carry on collecting. And we have some achievements. We have yet to go to an island. Oh, that's another thing on my list to do. I would love to go to an island. Okay, let's do some tree shaking. And pick up some of this fruit because it that sells really well as well uh, I'm gonna put the things we don't want to sell just down here in a pile the hand cart the iron nuggets and the tree bunch I really would love to pay off the bridge today otherwise it will just fester and never get done we can put that fossil down near the museum all right, one, two, three, four, five, six. That's all the coconuts. Some oranges. We have such a selective fruit, a selection of fruit. I love it. I love all the the um the weeds everywhere as well, and the random flowers. Whoops, we just picked a flower. Damn it! I did not mean to do that. Oh, and there is our rice, our little bush, bush tea. Rice? I don't know why I said rice. Tea. It's tea. A tea bush. The orange one, I think. Do I hear another balloon or is that just me? Drop this. Let's pick up the tea bushes and plant them around the houses. I love doing it over the other side, so I'm going to do it over this side near Faith's house. Um, let's get all the shell out. Ooh, let's put one near the Able Sisters over here. Orange tea stuff. I can hear a balloon. 100%. 100%. There it is. A blue balloon. Okay. No tree. I, I, I wanted to... Ah, okay. It's gone in the pumpkin patch. Hang on now. Got it. Cool. Uh, let's put a, a bush 
Can I just plant them without digging the hole? Yes, I can. <laughs> okay, that would have been way more simpler if I'd worked that out before. Okay, let's pick up this. And I want to catch this. There we go. Oh, there's another one on the beach. Let's go get that one as well. Money! For the name of money! Alright. And I'm pretty sure I saw the bug. There he is. A little stink bug. Cool. Right, how many teas, tea bushes do we have left to plant? One more after this. So that's a one for Faith over there. Um, and let's put one near our house. If I can find a spot, that is. Um, I could put one here instead of this leaf pile. There. And then let's put the leaf umbrella down. Ta-da! And just for funsies, before the end of this episode, I'm going to look at the mail. Oh, goodness. We have a lot of mail. So we're Happy Home Academy. Uh, over 3,000 points, which is fun. Uh, this is just interest in our bank. And Jack, <gasps> the Halloween mail! To my future loyal minions. <laughs> How funny. I'll be creeping through on October 31st. For Halloween, my dear pumpkins. Until then... Contemplate this portrait of yours truly and get to work gathering lots of candy. As all good minions should. Jack, the reigning Sikar, uh, Cesar. The Jack, the reigning star of Halloween. How cool. We're gonna save that and then everything else, I'm just gonna throw them away because we have too many in, our, in this little inbox now i think happy home academy thank you very much and then we have whoo lots of things from nook shopping wow a lot of compressors plants which i bought a frog t-shirt a mrs flamingo cake kk safari i try and buy the kk song every time so that's why we have so many music and a paisley bandana a world map we have the um the swimming suit which i bought which is really good because um, I wanted to do some marine diving and that gives us a lot of money from the marine insects. Ooh, a ladybird. Yes, please. All right, you guys. We'll open all that next episode. I'll see you guys then. Goodbye for now.